TGIF, everyone. It's the... And here in October, we have a little indication of what may be coming in the East. You and let's go straight over to the sideline for a report before they tip off. Hey, Allie. Thanks, Brian. Well, it might go without saying, but LaMelo Ball grew up in a basketball family at their home in Chino, California. Some intense games with his older brothers were played. LaMelo said, quote, they were serious, slamming into the gate. That's where you develop, hating to lose. Everybody's going hard. I wish I could have seen it, B.A. It's led to this, Allie. Thanks for that. So the Hornets starting five. Rozier the two with Hayward at the three. P.J. Washington out there with Mason Plumley. Here we go. And it's Ball in at the point. And for Miami, at the forward slots, Butler and Tucker. Kyle Lowry out there with Victor Oladipo. And it's Adebayo in at the five. And some new faces and new places this year, Grant. How long do you think it takes for a new player to fit in? Well, you know, some players Charlie never Ball. fit in. But depending Mason upon the Ball. style, it varies That's from player first, to player. First, first the former number two first overall Ball. pick in 2013, now Oladipo the gives you production, Victor but he also Oladipo. plays with a bit of an edge. <laughs> And he knocks down the first one. And no doubt, when he's rolling, Oladipo strikes fear in the hearts of the opponents. Yeah, B.A., I mean, he is merciless on the tack. He plays with so much heart and passion. Not much fun to play against, but he's exciting to watch. Here's Charlotte. Here's Ball. is the glass on the layup and setting the tempo with an assertive move like where was the defense on that play no excuse you have to be aware he should be on your radar all the time Lowry good hustling through contact one of Lowry's specialties very strong upper body ball outside Rozier with a screen on Lowry Ball passes to Plumley. It's good. And the assist that time from Ball. That's just good basketball. Can't ask for a better look. And now just over a minute played here in the first. Lowry against Ball. Stolen by Rozier. From outside the arc. Nails it from beyond the arc. The shot first mentality of Rozier on full display. Knows he can make the shot when it opens up. Adebayo finds Oladipo. Lowry, good. That's the pass you want. Orchestrating the offense, creating for others. Ball against Lowry. Ball passes to Washington. Back to Ball. Plumley a screen on Lowry. Six on the shot clock. Pass to Washington. To the paint. The kick out to Ball. And the Hornets. Another three. three. Yeah, you want to get him going as soon as possible. Great way for him to start this game. And we know once he gets in the rhythm, he's a really tough guy to stop. Here's Butler. Always a nice way to start. Makes his first one. Wow, the strength of Jimmy Butler fends off defenders well when he goes up to score. Ball outside. Outside for Rozier. No good from outside. There was a mix-up defensively. Left him all alone. He just couldn't hit it. Lowry, good. Gifted scores. I like when Lowry takes initiative and looks to capitalize inside. Ball against Lowry. Ball into the lane. Plumley. Yes, sir. And it's Ball with the assist that time. Ball's got three assists now in this one. Nice job. Those passes have to be right on the money around the painted area. And the lob disrupted. Not to be. Rozier outside. And first quarter, we're about three and a half minutes in. Launches it. 
He can't get that one to fall. And it's Miami the other way. They want to keep rolling here following the win against Brooklyn. And we all know that on the road, we don't usually look so comfortable on the offensive end. But that was the story of the game. Yeah, they look right at home. Except they weren't. Great job of blocking out the noise. Timeout, Charlotte. A big group substitution here for Miami. Edmonds checked in for Bam Adebayo. Struess comes in for Tucker. Robinson, he's checked in for Oladipo. And it's Hero in for Lowry. A big group substitution here for Charlotte. Bridges, he's checked in for Plumley. Oubre comes in for Hayward. Booknight, he's checked in for Rozier. And it's Smith in for Ball. Pass to Oubre. Shot clock at six. The fadeaway. Oh, thanks, Alan. He's 0 for 1 to start. You expect him to make that, especially from that distance. Struess's shot is off. Charlotte has gone 2 of 4 from distance to begin this one. Hero against Smith. And he can't get that one. The Heat go the other way with it. And this is the first season matchup for them against this Hornets team. And they were the odds-on favorite in this matchup last year, but actually lost the season series. A solid all-around player, Jimmy Butler, understands the importance of sharing the ball with open guys. Pass to Oubre. Here's Smith. Bridges, a screen-on hero. Back to Bridges. And it's Bridges with the jam. And because of his quickness, Ish draws defensive attention, opens up a passing lane to the roller. One minute left to play in the first quarter. Here's Deadman. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. Here's Hero. Hook Knight with a rebound. The Hornets have got six of ten attempts to fall. And here's Smith. 34 seconds left in the first quarter here. Screen by Bridges. Let's go with a three. Miami grabs the miss. Hero with it. 17 seconds left in the opening quarter. Butler against Smith. Nice D from Bridges. What a defensive play. Gets the stop and does it without foul. Talented, driven. He puts constant pressure on your defense. Kyle Lowry has been leading the charge for the Miami Heat. Eight points in the quarter, showing how effective he can be. And don't... Well, the Miami Heat, not all lottery picks are blue chip prospects, but... We got a team full of guys that can score, a team full of guys that can defend can get everybody else involved. Um, it's, a, it's a nice team, man. We're playing well. And Grant, you never want to write them off. <laughs> and when your team is made up of overachievers, they've got plenty of experience proving doubters wrong. If you're just joining us, we played through one quarter in this one. Let's quickly break down what we've seen from the Heat. They are looking engaged so far, especially on offense. And that has helped them build an advantage here, playing with good focus and good energy. On the court for Charlotte, Hayward and Bridges at the small and power forward spots. Kelly Oubre out there with ball. And it's Plumley in at the five, roaming the paint. Miles and the Bridges. basket by Bridges. And you like the balance here, not just falling in love with the three ball. Hero against Oubre. To the inside. Tucker inside. Back to Hero. Puts up a three. Ball with the rebound. Charlotte trailing. Just over a minute gone here in the second quarter. Bridges, a screen on Oladipo. Ball passes to Bridges. The score now all even. Bridges has got six. And guys, the way this defense is getting manhandled down low, you have to wonder if they're at 100% right now. Oubre with a steal. It's an even three-on-three -three break. Here's Hayward, and he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. From skinny college freshman to NBA all-star, 
quite the transformation for Gordon Hayward. All right, Smitty, you won some titles at the international Bam. level. Bam. World Championship That's in 94, first, first gold in 2000. First so how do those compare to the ring you won with the Spurs? You know, B.A., they're totally Gordon different. Hayward. Obviously, both of them are fantastic. But internationally, it's a little bit special because you're playing for your country and you have that USA across your jersey. Lowry, he's checked in for Miami. Rozier, he's checked in for Charlotte. A chance here to catch up with Ali from the sideline. Well, the Heat culture is all about work, and this roster is littered with overachievers. Jimmy Butler said, quote, the Miami Heat look for those diamonds in the rough. Players that are hungry, players that have some dog in them and play for one another. These guys do what it takes to be in the league for a while, Brian. Boy, they compete, right, Ali? Thanks for that. Very surprising. He gets the ball where he wants it in a decent matchup. Robinson gets the bucket. A fantastic passer for a big. Bam, terrific at finding his open teammates. The Hornets have gotten two of five shots to fall this second quarter. Rozier against Oladipo. Here's ball. And there's the call. It's on Bam Adebayo. That'll be a second foul of the game. Personal foul. Second team foul. Quarter two and just under two and a half minutes gone by. Here's Ball. He, he had a decent start, but this quarter has not been caught. That shot, no good. A capable score from all three levels. But what's really unique about Kyle Lowry is his physicality near the rim. He bullies defenders. Rozier can't get it to go. The Heat have gotten nothing to go out of five attempts so far this quarter. To the middle. And out of bio slams it in. Wonderful play with that long wingspan and huge hands. Otto Bio catches and finishes with ease. And something Lowry's always had, great strength. You know what? He helps set a physical tone for the team. That's what you expect from your seven-footer, not your six-footer. For three, Oladipo. Unable to get that one. And Charlotte going the other way now. Following this one, they host the Trailblazers. And that's the first of just two home games for them. Again, the miss by the Hornets. Yeah, just a little off his game this quarter. He's trying to work his way into a river. Pass to Adebayo. And here's Robinson, pounded by ball. Robinson passes to Lowry. Ooh, he's locked in. Drains his fifth shot in as many attempts. That's been the story of their offense so far. Getting a number of looks from point blank range. A different look for Miami. Edmonds checked in for Tucker. Jimmy Butler comes in for Robinson. And it's Struess in for Oladipo. Give up a hand, fans. And here's Washington. Back to Smith. On the wing, Rozier. A shot to stop the run. And it's Miami with a rebound. Adebayo's got his fifth rebound in this one. Pass to Lowry. Good! And the assist goes to Adebayo. And now a seven-point Miami lead. <laughs> they are passing the ball around tremendously right now. To the wing, right side. Washington, a screen on Butler. Now Washington, Butler covering. Basket counts. Washington's got his first points of the night. Terrific design and execution, leading to an opportunity right at the rim. Pass to Butler. 125 left to play in the first half. Butler double team. Here's Stroop. Oh, wow, wow. You took, oh. Did you say elevation? And after putting it down, he dangles from the rim a little. Man, that's borderline taunting right there, Grant. They're playing with a certain swagger right now. Man, how about our AT&T 5G slam can? Couldn't have captured that play any better. Fifty-six seconds left in the half. Smith against Lowry. They get it back. Pass to Adebayo. Butler with the ball. Clock at six. Shoots over Book Knight. Heat foul. Dwayne Denton. That's his first personal foul. And the Heat making a change here. Heroes checked in. And a change for the Hornets. 
Oubre, he's checked in for Rozier. Charlotte has gone 0 for 2 from outside in the second quarter. Smith against Lowry. And here's Oubre from the arc. After missing his first attempt, now 1 for 2. Taking what the defense offers up, Smith with good vision there finds the open man. Three seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Hero left side. Edmund good. And the Heat lead by six. Their ball movement on this run has been tremendous. It's led to a lot of good, clean, open looks. Smith outside. That'll do it for the first half. It's the Heat up by six. Well, now we have some time to check in with Allie LaForce. Allie. The away team, 25. I'm here with James Brago. Coach, you're hanging in there despite the subpar shooting from your team. What will it take to win this game? Same resiliency. We just got to keep fighting one possession at a time, find a group with great energy. Um, you know, we got to make some shots here. We haven't scored the ball so far this game, but still got a lot of time. Allie, as always, thank you. We'll be back right after the break for the third quarter here on 2K Sports. Welcome in for halftime. And what's on tap, you ask? I can answer. So far, it's been a nice outing for the Miami Heat. We have to recognize their bench play. Sometimes we overlook the second unit. But tonight, they've been the key. The coaching staff has got to be loving this. Getting that extra boost is huge. And now we can look at the latest power rankings. And again, don't stare directly at them like an eclipse. Just take a glance. Let's see who's on top. When I look at Miami, they delivered the goods so far. Uh, after all the preseason chatter, they've shown that they're one of the top teams. Now, they just got to keep with Justin, and can they keep this up the rest of the year? We shall see. Thanks for tuning in. Now it's time to head back over to Brian Anderson for the start of the third quarter. Second half of basketball is upon us, and we may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game we've seen so far. What can you say? Kyle Lowry, an impressive effort here today. What makes him an exciting player is the ultra-aggressive mindset that we saw over and over in the first half. And not standing around, not selling for perimeter shots. He's, he's looking to attack. Inside, it's Adebayo with Tucker playing the four. Kyle Lowry out there with Victor Oladipo. And it's Butler in a small forward. That's the group on the floor for Miami. It's Lowry with a drive. Count it. Lowry's got 14 points for the game. Very little resistance around the rim right now. That's the fifth straight bucket they've given up in the paint. Jimmy Butler, one of the great two-way wings we have. Some call him the most complete wing. Hard to argue with the defense he plays. Rozier gets the bucket. An improved shooter from downtown. Rozier has been consistent in adding this to this game over the years. Outside Tucker. Back to Lowry. Fires the three. Pumley pulls down the board. And with Butler in his defense, he is a menace. Brings intensity and energy every game. Also add the versatility with who he can guard. Always a threat to come up with a steal. He's an elite defender. Hayward finds Plumley. The three from Washington. And again, Charlotte with the triple. And the defense is really allowing them too much room on the perimeter. Time called here. Miami, Miami decides to talk time. it over. There's no way coach likes this effort level. They need to refocus. It's so easy to get run over when you lose even a little edge. Look for them to come out much more aggressive. And taking a look at last year's stats. Here were the players that led the way in terms of steals. Jimmy Butler on top. And we saw how effective he was on defense last season. Taking pride in mucking things up and being an absolute pest, grabbing all those steals. It's out of bio, high post. Plumley on him. 
So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Terry Rozier picks one up. Well, Oladipo's game features a lot of speed. If you don't keep up with him, he'll make you pay. First free throw is good. That one falls, so he hits both of them. Over a minute and a half now into this third quarter action. Ball outside. Banked it in off the glass. Ball's got his third bucket of the night. The defense couldn't collapse quickly enough. Lowry, the pass to Butler. Back to Lowry. From behind the arc. Good, and Butler gets the assist. Butler's got four assists in the game. Adds to their lead. They've been able to rely on him all night. Ball against Lowry. Now here's Ball. Guarded closely. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. It goes on Bam out of bio. And he drops the first. Robinson, he's checked in for Miami. Hero comes in for Lowry. And a change for the Hornets. Oubre's checked in. And so Ball nails both of them. The Heat have got two of three from the floor in this third quarter. Adebayo sets a screen. He was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. That's his second personal foul. And with Tyler Hero, he's shown he can score. He has a skill set to get consistent points and knows how to find his spots on the floor. And Hero is solid without the ball as well. Great movement. Yeah, I mean, he's still improving in that area, but his backdoor cuts are getting better. He really knows how to get easy scores that way. Just needs to learn to not settle for those off-balance shots. And here's Oubre from the arc. Oladipo with the rebound. You gotta love how they've been crashing the boards, fighting hard for every miss. Pass to Robinson. Out of bio with it. He's checked by Plumley. Oh, sweet move. And out of bio, the bucket on the assist from Robinson. Out of bio's got his second bucket on the night. And out of bio over to help. Inside. Oh, deflected. Hero with it. Picked up by Plumley. For three, Robinson knocks down the long take. And now an eight-point heat lead. Firing on all cylinders here in the third. Only one miss in five attempts. And Hero comes to help. Can they get it? Oubre, that one's good. Oubre's got six. They're having a good half offensively, shooting over 50% from the field now, trying to close the gap. Outside Robinson. Hero on the wing. Pass to Adebayo. Down to five on the shot clock. For three, Oladipo. No good that time. Charlotte has gone three of four from outside in the second half. Robinson with a double. Now here's Oubre. It's good. And the assist that time from Ball. Ball's got assist number eight now on the night. Time called here. Miami decides to talk it over. All right, fans. Get on your feet and make some noise. It's... A different look for Miami. Deadman comes in for Adebayo. And it's Struess in for Oladipo. Your Miami Heat dancers! Give up a hand, fans. Your Miami Heat dancers! Here's Hero. He's got five. And he goes in for the dunk. This is what separates Tyler Hero from other shooters. He can get up and dunk it. Hero against Smith. Down low. Here's Oubre. Rebounded by Butler. Butler's got four rebounds in the game. A minute 20 left to play in the third quarter here. Hero against Smith. Back to Hero. 
Wide open look. And there are the Heat with another bucket. From that range, Tyler is money. Well inside his comfort oh, zone as a shooter. Hero against Smith. Got a hand on it. Second chance effort. Hayward's shot is off. For Miami, they've gotten six of eight shots to go and looking good since the break. Pass to Struess. Hero with it. Puts it up from 15. Butler can't get it to go. Charlotte has gone six for 12 from deep so far in this game. Shot clock and game clock separated by less than six seconds. He's hot this quarter, getting the shots he wants. And he's delivered. A different look for Miami. Tucker's Miami checked in for Jimmy Butler. Duncan and it's Robinson. Kyle Lowry in for Robinson. Here's Hero. 20 seconds left in the third quarter. Up and over Smith. Hero, no good. Smith against Lowry. Pass to Booknight. Takes a three. The shot, no good. Shots continuing to fall as we conclude the third. Both teams putting up some points. Heat out in front, up four. And All right, look who's coming onto the court. And meanwhile, Eric Spolstra rallying the troops. Heat, get the rebound into those corners, race for it, okay? What you're doing right now is you're making them have to defend. And Coach Foe imploring his guys to be faster and sharper than the other team. If they do that, they'll be fine. Coach wants to tire the opposition out on defense. And with three quarters behind us, we'll start the fourth in what is still anybody's ball game. On the court for the Hornets. Bridges and Washington are inside. Ball at point with Rozier next to him. That's the backcourt. And it's Oubre in at the three. A small forward. Pass to Washington. Ball outside. Count it and one. He'll have a chance at a three-point play. That'll belong to Kyle Lowry. Rozier, he's checked in for Charlotte. LaMelo Ball, one. Here's Lowry. And he drives in. Book it. He's now 9 for 11 after that one. Look how quick Lowry is on the drive. Zipping past the defense before they can react. Pass to Rozier. Three-pointer. It's good. And the assist that time from Ball. Ball's got assist number 9 now. What an effort here tonight. Now here's Lowry. Fourth quarter still young. Just over a minute play. Out to Oladipo. Now out of bio. Clock at four. Let's it go from deep. Lowry no good. And that's a strong closeout defensively. Great effort to deter the shot. Here's Ball. And Tucker pulls it down. The Heat with the lead. Pass to Adebayo. Oh, it's blocked by Washington. Ball outside. Back to Washington. The ball's knocked loose. Lowry with it. Now guarded by Rozier. Lowry, the pass to Adebayo. Yep, that one's good. And the Heat lead by four. All right, guys, let's get your take on the hustle stats for Miami. They've been playing such pesky defense. It's been very impressive, especially all the turnovers they've caused. I'll tell you something else. The points they've scored on the fast break tonight have been a major factor. Ball against Lowry. Rozier outside. Charlotte needs to get one up in a hurry. Here's Ball. And once again, off the mark by Charlotte. Miami has gotten five of 11 threes to drop so far in this game. To the paint. And Tucker gets it to go. Now it's a six-point heat lead. Drawing so much attention. Oladipo rotates the ball to the open man. Lowry against ball. 
Outside Ubre. Ball against Lowry. And it's ball off the drive. That's good. And now he's 5 for 11 in this one. A much different player here in the second half. He's taking advantage of what the defense allows. Paul's timeout. It's T-shirt Butler's checked in for Miami. Robinson comes in for Oladipo. Plumley's checked in for Charlotte. Well, over the break, I listened in on Eric Spolster's huddle. He told them both play as if it's 0-0. We want that type of energy and focus. We might be winning, but this game is not over yet. It's a clear message, guys. Butler against Bridges. Here's Ball. Here's Washington. Rebound by the Heat. Adebayo's got his seventh rebound here tonight. Pass to Tucker. Good, and Butler gets the assist. And the Heat lead by six. One, it's time out call. Who wants a teacher? All right, look who's coming onto the court. Come on and get out for the Miami Heat dancer. in for Robinson. We played just over three and a half minutes now in the fourth quarter. Lowry against Ball, and it's Jimmy Butler with the foul. That's his first foul. Second team foul. Ball against Lowry. From 17, and he gets it to go, hitting off the back of the rim. <laughs> Stepping up in the big moment. I mean, <laughs> an incredible job of finding his shot. Working the mid range, but you would think the defense would be keying on him. 151 left to play in the fourth quarter. Here's Butler, and he gets it to go. A good interior score. Jimmy Butler using his strength and explosiveness to full effect. Rozier outside. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. The defense there doing whatever they can to protect the rim. And he cannot get the first one to drop. Tough on the miss. And he does get the second one. And that brings him within five. No way he is happy with himself right now. He knows he has to knock every shot down at this point in the game. And there's the whistle. That'll go on Terry Rozier. That'll be a second foul of the game. First team foul. Bridges against Butler. A minute 22 left in the game. Hero, the pass to Lowry. Just five to shoot. The Heat need to get one up in a hurry. Butler can't get it to go. Charlotte has gone 7 of 14 from the perimeter in this one. Ball against Lowry. Three-pointer Rozier. And he buries it. And he's brought them within two points now. There is absolutely no fear in his eyes. He loves the moment. Incredible shot with everything on the line coming through for his team. And that three-pointer is big. Cancels out the triple at the other end and helps stretch out their lead. Rozier outside. Three-pointer. Oh, that trifecta! And neither side right now giving an inch. We'll see who cracks first. And I think we'll see him milk the clock a bit. Yeah, seems like the heady move right now. Here's Adebayo. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. It goes on Mason Plumley. 
business Second as usual for Adebayo, just bullying his now way around the paint. He hits the first one, and that makes it a three-point lead. Hayward, he's checked in for Bridges. So he gets them both. And it's a four-point ball game. Tremendous showing of confidence by getting those two to fall. Six-second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Goes here outside from deep. Here's ball. Oh, he nails it! What vision from Rozier there. Seeing his teammate was wide open and making the right pass. Timeout called to the heat. It's time for... Steel. And it's the Hornets on the break. Hayward, left side. Pass to Rozier. Ball outside. Rozier outside to take the lead. Can't knock in the three. And they go to the intentional foul. That's his fourth personal foul. Third team foul. Now at the line, Bam Adebayo. And that hurts as he doesn't get the first one to fall. Trying to focus now for the second. His game is defined by heart and hustle. Bam Adebayo would be walking by any coach on any team in any league. All right, look who's coming out of the court. Tremendous finish. They waited until the very last moment to seal it. And so many times we see these close games won by the home team. Well, now a minute to check in with Allie LaForce. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. 64. All right, Jimmy, as you prepared for this one, what was the focus? Uh, just how hard we had to play home or away. I think we did that to stay together. Um, through their run, draw run. And that was quality, and that's going to be stuff. Four great quarters of work. Congrats on the win. Allie, thank you as always. And that'll do it, folks. So for Grant Hill, Allie LaForce, and Steve Smith, I'm Brian Anderson thanking everyone for watching tonight's game as New Balance presents our player of the game, Kyle Lowry.